So this is a review of Blasto for the PS1. And you'd think from looking at the cover that this would be a cool game. You'd think that this had a cool looking new superhero. Then on the back of the game you notice the developers even had some humor. See, uh, you look up at the top here, it says, Blasto is here to save your anus. <laughs> oh, you clever developers. I, I see that clever little wordplay you guys did there. Nobody's ever thought to link that word, the word anus with the planet Uranus before. <laughs> oh, well done. Well done, you clever guys, you. The first thing you're going to notice when playing this game is how stiffly Blasto moves. The controls are as stiff as Bicentennial Man's erection. He controls like an inflatable doll instead of a platform character. Also, Blasto can barely run. You feel like you're controlling Michael Moore or Rosie O'Donnell in this game, not a superhero. Blasto needs to cut down on the cheeseburgers and cheesecake and start doing some cardio. It's way too easy to walk Blasto off of a ledge. He has no survival instinct whatsoever. He can only perform four other actions in this game. You gotta sidestep, you can fire your weapon, you can jump, and you can press buttons. You know, growing up, I loved this game. And you know what? Part of me still does. But it's just, there are parts in this game that are just so undeniably bad. I mean, just, geez louise, you, Turning, it takes, it's like Bubsy 3D, it takes forever to turn. The controls are just, it's, he's, the character is so stiff. I mean, there are just, it's undeniable that there are things in this game that were left undone. There are things that still need to be improved on, and there needs to be some twerking on my crotch. I, I mean, tweaking done to this game. Oh my gosh, look at how Blasto is moving. It's like if you tape somebody's body up to their face in duct tape and told them to start running. Does Blasto have any joints? Does Blasto have arthritis? I think Blasto needs to consult with a chiropractor about this. Am I, I'm worried for his own future and well-being. This is, I mean, it's sad how he moves. And he's supposed to be a superhero? What? Now, the main objectives of each level in this game is to save different uh, big-breasted babes. Uh, you'd think these babes would be really grateful and, and do something for Blasto in reward, but all they do is say, like, one word and just kind of disappear. They don't even give, they don't even give them a, a kiss, not even a peck on the cheek. I mean, jeez, Louise, it reminds me of my many nights at the bars, hitting on girls and just... Two things would happen, jack and shit, and that's exactly what happens in this game. You save these cunts, and they do jack shit. They are not grateful. It just feels like you're doing a lot of work for just to save an ungrateful cunt. I mean, how about a Hummer, at least? I, I, I know Blasto's been using a few too many steroids, but come on. You women are dressed like whores. At least do something beneficial for him. I mean, he did only... JUST SAVED YOUR FUCKING LIFE! DAMN IT! FUCKING BITCHES! Blasto's depth perception is awful. You will die a lot in this game, and not because you suck, but because the game is programmed badly. It's similar to Bubsy 3D, but I, I don't think it's quite as bad as that. I mean, the enemies are easy enough to kill. This game is not impossible. It's just, there's clearly broken movements. Jumping in the platforming is just, it's broken. There are, there are issues at different parts of these levels. And uh, you will get frustrated in this game. Now, you might be asking yourself, gee, does this game have maps? I mean, it just looks like he's going in circles here. Well, the answer is yes. Yes, this game does have maps. But in order to look at it, you have to find it first. It's these white platforms that are in random spots on each level. And I found myself asking, why in the fuck couldn't you have just put an option to look at the map on the pause menu? Also, where am I supposed to go here? Where's the motherfucking exit at? How out of touch with reality does one have to be to program a game with a map 
and not label any exits or objectives on it. What the fuck is this? It looks like a fucking mall. Fuck off! That is like programming a game with a tutorial that has nothing to do with how to play the game. This is mind-numbing to me. Why the fuck do you have a map that doesn't show me where the fuck I am or where the fuck I'm supposed to fucking go? Damn it! I just want to finish off with saying that this game is not a completely lost cause. Okay, Blasto has a few good things going for it. In each level, you can save. There are at least two different spots where you can save in each level. Which, you know, most bad games can't say that. This is one of those bad games where at least you can save. At least it doesn't take you back to the beginning of the fucking game after you die. That's one of the pluses this game has. Another one is the soundtrack. Blasto's soundtrack is... It's very appropriate for the environments and the... Um, the, the mood of the game, it goes well with it, it's, it's catchy, the soundtrack is good, and also Phil Hartman voiced Blasto, which Phil Hartman's a, a great comedian, uh, rest in peace buddy, and uh, you know, Blasto says a lot of funny things, there's a lot of funny sayings in the game, and the game's charming, but other than that, the game's awful, I mean everything else is bad. So uh, yeah, that's the review, you know this game obviously it had a lot of potential, Part of me still likes this game, but there is no denying that this is an awful game. Period. End of story. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. And goodbye, my friends. Bosk? I thought that pear-headed psychopath was banished to the fifth dimension. He was, but now he's back and he's mad. The very foundation of the free planetary system may be at stake. His forces are already massed for an invasion of the planet Uranus. And you want me to take it back, eh? Can you do it, Blasto? Is a frog's butt water tight? I knew we could count on you, Blasto. Good luck. And remember, Uranus is on the line. So what else is new?